major projects and the issue of relocation. In the process of preparing for mega events, relocation and enforced demolition is a common phenomenon. In order to build sports venues, accommodation, roads and the future demands for space, all these demands often require removal of the existing residential, open up space for new buildings. Often mega projects are organised by government authorities to revi revitalise the city. However, in most cases, an orderly and sensitive movement of local residents is not given due process, nor are residents provided with adequate compensation or alternative shelter. In fact, these residents', residents are, rights are rarely acknowledged. They have to leave the area and their rights to return to the transformed region cannot be guaranteed. Two case studies highlight the social and community implications of forced removal and relocation, including the Beijing Olympic Park precinct and the Melbourne Public Housing Estates. China's relocation policy leaves citizens no choice but to move. The central government decides to demolish certain areas and the people who live in those areas are forced to relocate. The process begins with the word chai, to be demolished, is sprayed on the wall of the buildings that are going to be destroyed. Within the Melbourne public housing estates, the legal, social, community and of course financial costs of relocating existing public housing residents was considered closely. So how can residents be moved without conflicting social objectives and expectations of the community?